In this morning's Healthy Living, January is National Blood Donor Month, and if you have never donated blood before, it is worth considering. As Dr. Thomas Waters with Cleveland Clinic explains, hospitals are always looking to increase their supply. Blood that is donated can be used for surgical patients who are undergoing surgery, for trauma patients who've had a significant injury, or patients with other medical conditions that might require a transfusion. According to the Red Cross, every two seconds, someone in the United States needs blood or platelets, and the most common type of blood requested by hospitals is type O. For those who have never donated, the blood donation process is relatively simple. First, you'll complete a donor registration, then go over your health history, and do a mini physical. From there, a medical professional will hook you up for the blood draw, which typically takes between eight to 10 minutes. If you're donating platelets, red cells, or plasma, it can take up to two hours. Dr. Waters has some advice for those who may be nervous to donate. Well, there are a lot of people out there who are afraid of needles. Um, so uh, understandably, it can be a scary uh, event to undertake. But it is r safe. It's very simple. It's relatively painless. You'll feel a little pinch. Um, it only takes a few minutes. And again, it can be life-saving for someone who needs a transfusion. To find a blood drive near you, you can call your local hospital or visit the Red Cross website.